Hello and welcome back to Let's Play The Last Days. And I've done some off screening, done a few quests, did some um, browsing on the forums, finding some stuff in there. Um, most interestingly, st most interestingly thing that happened is I leveled up twice. But I found on the forums that you have a arena. I actually didn't know that. So then you got, you say I need some training here. Talk to this guy. I'm ready for some training, and you choose gauntlet and choose your favorite weapon. Now I'm going to use one-handed weapons because, well, oh great! You start off against walks. Oh bloody boy! I wish I had more iron flesh right now. Now I hope I can knock this guy off this walk and take it for me own. Ow. Now, as you guys know, I'm not really that good in combat. As you see, I keep getting damage. Okay, so I'm coming to mount this thing and now we're in business. Now, let's get some range. Turn around and start smacking them. There we go. Come on. It's pretty damn hard to fight in such a confined area. Oh. I don't want to. Don't want to die yet. Because that seems to be a waste of time. There we go. I wish I got a more decent weapon, honestly. This w thing has no range. Now, I don't really want to hit the mount, to be honest, because there may be a chance for me to pick that one up again. At least the guy's shield is uh, gone. Oops. Running around on walks, on smacking each other with clubs. Okay, so wave two is some ground units. So those are easy picking. And one walk. Now, I'm not too worried about these ground units because I can just simply run through them. But the guy on the walk though is a bit annoying of course. Because there's a pull arm or thrown weapon, I don't know what it's um, rated as. I believe it's a thrown weapon. Yeah, I'll just keep running over the ground, people. Oh. Because that's a lot easier to do. Yeah, there was some, there was some advice about doing this with, with thrown weapons, but... You know, you know me, I uh, ignore all advice given. That is on forums. Okay, hit me. Okay, there we go. Oh, how did I... Okay, so wave three. Oh, God. Received a cushion some damage. I don't know if I can actually do this properly. Probably not. So I'm not that good against mounted units without my uber gear. Ow. See, I'm already close to dying. And it may also beca be because I have very low iron flesh. They said that that was almost a must to do. Now, so we got wave 2. Not that too shabby. But I want to get to see if I can get to wave uh, 5. I may off-screen this though. Um, let's go with the throne weapons. Or we'll press X. Is it X? No, shit. I don't know the controls. Um, let's see. Attack, defend. Hmm. What's the swappy weapon? 
button. Take a screenshot. Control. No, it's not what I want. So party. Uh, some of you probably already found it. Safe. Retreat. Sheath. Weapon. New. Hmm. This is um, slightly confusing. I'm very sure you you were able to um, swap the way you would use your weapon. Um, quite nice to figure that out in the middle of combat. <coughs> oh, there we go. We're going to smack the bits. Okay, that was not a good idea. Hmm. Okay, let's try that again. Um. <sighs> One and thrown. I just want to check out the um, button for it without being completely overrun. I'm just pressing pressing random buttons now. I'm pretty sure. That with X or something, yeah, it would have secondary function. Could be that they removed it. Um, so throw weapons, not a good idea. Okay. Um, okay, I'll give it one more try, and if that doesn't work, I'll off-screen it. Yes, yeah, so yeah, no, I choose a poor one, but that's so I can easily knock off that guy. If I hit him. Of course, I don't do any damage with it. But I like the range on it. Cushion launch damage. Let's spam. Okay, so now just that guy. Come on. Pull it back. There we go. And. Damn it. Because lancing on a mount is pretty damn easy, to be honest. The other way around, it's not. Especially when. Uh, I should prevent him from uh, trying to overrun me. He blocked, but I still hit the mount. Huh. Interesting. Come on. How are we on athletics right now? I'm only three. I should have done this at night. Received zero damage. Nice. Now I don't want to hit the mount too bad because I want to actually get it. Pick it up. Oh. Damn it. Well, at least wave two is not um, full of. Um, ow, ow, ouch. What I wanted to say was not full of walks, but. Okay, I am going to actually off screen this, I guess. So, because this is going to take me about a full 30, 40 minutes to complete this. So, I'll be right back. And welcome back. I'm only. I finally managed to get up to wave um, 6 with quite a bit of luck to be honest. I started against uh, a mounted walk in the first wave, that was it. Managed to... two hits, pulled them off with the pull arm and uh, went on from there. So yeah, good going and a um, little bit of luck. So we did receive, I checked it already, but uh, just so you so guys can see. Traits Orc Pit Champion. You've become renowned as a brutal warrior who has been able to survive the cruelest of Orcs fighting contests. Such strength is both respected and feared by your black hearted followers, and they now receive a weekly morale bonus. Yippee. Now, there are several more arenas, and I'm, I may, may do them all, may not do them all. See, can I sit, ask that guy for training? I'm in for training, gauntlet, pull arms. Uh, 
disadvantage here right now is um well that's a disadvantage the fact that they've got arrows secondly I don't think I can actually ride on a horse weirdly enough though my poor arm did not seems not my levels did not save previous fight weird enough hmm Now, as long as there are not any horses, I'm quite good, actually. Idiot. Standing there with your weapon drawn. Wave two. See, now we're bound. Ouch. Oh, that, that hit me for quite a bit, actually. Oh, crap. Can I move around here? I need a mount. I need a mount. Come on, give me... This is impossible to keep doing this on the ground. I should have chosen to do this at night. I don't know if you, if you could do this at night, but... Uh, come on. Come on, will you die already? So yeah, I've been doing this the past 40 minutes or so. Not against these guys, of course, but against the orcs, but... There we go. Now that... Oh, that guy's an archer! Uh, how unlucky can you get, I guess? Um, now, interesting question of the day. Can I pick up any weapons? Yes, I can. Never really did in the other one. Can't really be bothered. But no throwing weapons, so we need to wait till the guys are out of ammo, I guess. That can uh, take a while. I look a little bit weird, though, in my white shirt. Come on, how much arrows do you. How many arrows do you have got left? Oh, come on. My nice white little shirt, feeling like a gentleman. Can I pick up the spear? No. Oh! Barely managed to dodge that. Come on! There he is, out of freaking arrows, finally. Luckily, horses don't have that much of a charge bonus as wargs do. <coughs> Um, don't kill the mound. Missed. Actually, this is easier in first person. Because you can just aim with the uh, tip of your staff. Or pull arm. Whatever you want to call it. Missed. Damn it. Just let's stand here, let him come to me. I'll just duck and weave. How did I miss that? Um, okay. At least hit him. It's more than happened last few tries. Yeah, it's. I find it hard to stab him. Hello. Okay, I'm just going to swing. Ah. This is taking forever. Nice. That's how it should be done. Um, okay. Hit. Come on, hit him in the back. Okay, he found the edge. <sighs> Come on. Yes, keep him there. Oh. Come on! Crying out loud. Let's stand on the edge ourselves so he runs straight into it. 
Huh. Let's go in there, butt face. There we go. Okay, we can actually mount it. Now, it is easy. Easier. Still not easy, it's still damn hard. Cushioned lance blows. Those are awesome. Seem to have some trouble actually steering this thing. Mount charge for 33 damage. I thought these things had reduced charge damage, but I guess I was wrong. Uh, maybe. With a little bit of luck, I can even make this to the final wave. And you can actually see, see me do it. Oh god. There we go. Ow! Okay, that's bad. I should seriously not try to uh, slow down. And engage them on an equal base. What are you, what you call it? Equal footing. Come on, let me at least make this wave. Okay. One more. This guys really know how to steer these things because I have the hardest time in the world actually to pull that off. Yes, 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 yes. There we go. Oh shit. Damn it. Keep behind him. Wait for him to run into the wall again. And then we plow spear through him or our stick stave ow bloody bastard oh that's unlucky well now you know how it goes there we go leave so, we still have the quest of rescuing for 14 prisoners. I've been looking into that, and that is actually a bit, little bit harder than I thought it would be. It seems that the enemy side is, in, in general, losing more people and not taking any prisoners. So, yeah. Are we going to engage in this fight? There are some orc stragglers here, actually, so they will immediately charge me when we get out of this. How am I looking? Oh, you're actually level up. Yeah, you can level them pretty easy with um, um, just doing some quests. Up some riding, more agility, one-handed weapons. There we go. Never mind. So we got a great war rider of Udun, walk rider of Gorgonoth. We got mainly a lot of ground troops, actually. Uh, oh wait, no, never mind. It's twelve of them. I thought it was two. Um, yeah, I recruited some orcs just to get a little bit, a little bit more um, cavalry. Because there is actually a trait where um, you've got enough cavalry. You um, gain a cavalry commander uh, trait, and that gives you the ability to heal your people, actually. And there's some kind of berserker trait, and then you need to run around the map, I believe, naked. <laughs> and uh, not wearing any body armor, at least, and I don't think you're allowed to wear a mount. Wear a mount, ride one, of course, and kill uh, as many as you can. Um, yeah, it's pretty damn hard if you ask me. Okay, got him on the ground. Killed now. Too bad the orcs don't really have uh, any uh, pole arms that they can use. Um, oh, mount! Oops. 
Ouch. Come on. Come on. Oh, my people are getting overrun here. Ouch, four damage. Yeah, I really should up my iron flash a little bit, I guess. We'll do that um, next few levels we gain. Limit zero damage. You gotta be joking, right? Zero damage. Nothing at all. Now, also, I was looking into the influence rewards. I could actually get a damn nice walk, uh, helmet, and armor if I um, get about rank 8 and 9, I believe, is what I need for it. So it will take quite a while. And, yeah, rank 9 is the max rank. And when I got get the max rank, I can actually inf start influencing uh, the war a little bit. Come on, come on. How it's a terrible clusterfuck, this battle. It's even worse than normal. I don't even... I hardly have the feeling I'm hitting anything. I'm getting kills, though. Just made two. But, yeah. We kill all of them. Okay, there we go. Now, there are quite a lot of traits, traits you can gain. Um, um, honestly, I only know a few of them. That's the arena, the running around naked, or having a certain amount of unit with you. Like, if, if you have about, I don't know, a lot of archers, you gain the archery commander, and when you, when you press H, you can heal your people. Wow. Everybody charge. Seriously, the amount of archers still in here? I mean, horsemen. It's too damn high. Oh, that's friendly troop. Let's not hit those. I actually had the hope when I started the arena for the first time that it would be in my full armor, but of course it wasn't. I could have. I would have known, could have known, should have known. Because mainly I'm not dying, it's because I'm wearing kick ass gear. There we go. Now, for the influence points items, I believe for the helmet, last helmet you can get, you need about 50 influence points for that. For the army, it's 45. Maybe 40 for the warg or something like that, or sword. You need a lot of it, at least. And it's dependent on your rank and on your level, apparently. So apparently we are too low level to see the next rewards in line, because we only see two, and we are a higher rank than that. Uh, let's kill this guy real quick. Oh, there we go. Let's see. A lot of ranking points and another influence point. Nice. There we go. We're fuck is wounded again, as usual. Um. Some soldiers are ready to upgrade. Great! Another fell Uruk of Mordor. Alright, so. Okay, they are leaving. Um, what kind of. S um. What are they carrying? Uh, st stop it! Uh, let's row here, Rim. So you saw there, uh, this is Orc Pit Champion morale increase. That's because of the new trait we just got. Isn't that nice? Okay, let's see. Um, is there a... L no, there's no leader here. Speak to the camp chief. How can I shove a cost? Don't need anything. Okay, go to the smithy. Sell off some of this junk. Yeah, we're getting incredibly rich. It is ridiculous. But honestly, I don't really mind. Now, I am right now level 23, so I actually want to check in with um, Maranon. Um, 
to see if I can get something there. A new influence item because I want that big ass walk to be honest because that seems to seem to me like a hell of a decent mount. Let's see. Let's speak to the chief. I'm gonna surf. Sure. Leaf and let's go to the leader's cave. I actually took about 15 minutes for me to figure out where I could go um, for the arenas because I couldn't find it on the internet and yeah pretty damn stupid I felt when I figured it out. Request a special item. I'm not sure if these if if you can live and lose these. I'm actually going to take them both. Why not? So we got two items. Okay. And this gives me one to athletics. Now you can't okay these don't have any um what do you call it? Um durability like usually. Oh, actually got some cram rations as well. You get them from um, destroying supply caravans. Um, but yeah. Let's talk to the supply train. Where do you need to go? To the Orc Sentry Camp. Well, that is actually qu quite a bit away. That's uh, right over there. So we need to get these guys safe. Should not be that hard. Actually, I'm going to do something. Let's see if we can eat these guys. Okay. There we go. You can go. And tell your people of me killing you for food. Yeah, there were some. I know a few other traits how to get, but for one, I need to uh, le lose a one of our generals. We can swear to hunt down the ones who did this. Um, the other one is just killing a lot of uh, enemy commanders or bashing them unconscious. Um, one of the two. Oh, wait, do you have got any work for me? Um, sure, I can scout an enemy town. No problem. But yeah, I try to. Um, to tell them where to go, something like that, and they said, well, you need to have that rank, and then I checked, looked up on the internet, and it said that rank is rank 9, which is still the max rank, and then you can actually uh, do a, bit, a little bit of influence. Now, you can actually get a trade by commanding these small groups around, I believe. Um, maybe these smaller war parties is actually what you need to do for, for that, instead of the scout parties, of course. Now, there you go. One of our guys improved to level 6. Party, you talk. Tell me about your skills. You need to really stop dying. If you don't mind. So I need to put another point in strength. He wears decent armor, so he shouldn't die that quick, if you ask me. Now let's see if we can find a war party and give them some suggestion, I guess. There we go. Nope, I guess not. Huh. Brutho, maybe I can give you a suggestive course of action. I have a new task for you. Yes, go to... Um, Eastus Gilead. I don't know. Mine is 18 remaining. Oh, that's bad. So, yeah. You can only tell them to go, apparently, to uh, friendly towns. Okay, um, go to the castle, because now she's in here. Not that I wanted to do that, actually, I wanted to just check it out, but uh, do you've got any tasks for me? I'll do it. Alright, I need to follow some guy to a meeting. Um, first of all, I need them to find the guy. Let's see. Follow the spy to the meeting. Prudent asks that he will leave us. Be careful not to let the spy see you on your way. So, has he left already? There's one scout over there. Two over here. I can't see him. That may be a little bit of a problem. 
there was some one guy running over here. No, that clearly is a scout, because otherwise I would have filled my quest already. Huh. Where did he go? Because these guys normally need to be blue, I guess, but I did not see anything blue leaving. And there's too many tracks here to even follow a single one of them. You can have my orc. Let's see. That I can't find it. The spy. I've lost it already. I think. Maybe I. Oh, sorry. Need to wait for um, it to pop out. No. Not can it anything I don't think this spot how long do I've got for this quest well I can't do it apparently oh wait is that no there's a lone rider um, around Lynn here locations um, L. W. Um, there we are. Show on map. you are got to be joking, right? You're letting me scout that far away? Bolstered. I God damn it. Well. Guess that's it for today. I want to thank you guys for watching. And see you guys next time. Bye bye.